What does reasonable expectation of privacy mean? The Fourth Amendment only prevents police from conducting unreasonable searches or seizures of things or places that essentially belong to you. For the property to belong to you, it has to be something that people know belongs to you, is controlled by you, and generally won't be used and are seen by the public. You can't claim to have a reasonable expectation of privacy over something that belongs to someone else, even if that object contains evidence against you. Before you can claim the police have violated your Fourth Amendment rights by seizing or searching something, um, you have to show that you have this reasonable expectation of privacy over it. The principle that you have the right to challenge an officer's actions as a constitutional violation is known as standing. Now, basically it's saying that if you're a private citizen, like the majority of, of us are, you have a reasonable expectation of privacy. And these people, well, I'm not going to say these people because specifically we're talking about the police. So the police cannot just go through your wallet and just go through your things. You have a reasonable expectation of privacy over that. Now, if it's something that is public, right, say like your social media, if it's public, then you don't have a reasonable expectation of privacy because you opened it public. So understanding this reasonable expectation of privacy knows what the police can and cannot use against you.